The Goa government and the Portuguese government on Saturday signed the MOUSS and work on the work on water management, sanitation and sewerage. The PWD minister promised that they would try and reduce the non-renewable resource waste to 10% from the current 25 to 30 percent. Here's more. PWD Minister Sudin Tavlikar and Portugal's Environment Minister Jose Pedro Mato Fernandes said that this MOU that had a validity of two years was a statement of political will and would go on way in improving the collaboration between the two countries not only in the present subjects but also other ventures like tourism. As uh, memorandum of understanding between government of Portugal and government of Goa he has signed the law. Here is the water supply, sanitation and sewerage. अशे विषय जो पुर्तगाली गवर्नमेंट का बरोबर एमओयू कहला यहाँ ये तो मेजर जब प्रॉब्लम्स आ साम का उत्काज है कारण हम जगह डे इन शंभरी इन सब कोई आउट पट्टा अन्य हम उधा कोई जरूरत आता है जैसे संबंध दुर्यात वाता अन्य नदियाँ वाता यहाँ का तेरा मैं उपाय योजना की जंगल पाची उधा स्टोर कर क्या खतिर हमी प्रोविजन दशक करता है लीकेजेस एंड ऑल द शॉर्टफॉल बीन दैट बी दैट इज़ व्हाट आई से इन एनआरडब्ल्यू एनआरडब्ल्यू इज़ द बेस्ट इन जापान व्हिच इज़ फाइव परसेंट आफ्टर दैट इज़ सिंगापुर व्हिच इज़ फाइव टू एट परसेंट एंड देन इन लिस्पन स्पेशली पोर्टुगल व्हिच इज़ � and now, same technology we will be using from Portuguese. Definitely, we will see that in next couple of years, our control of NRW will be less than 10%. It's not just a problem of old pipes. It's a problem of management, a problem of pressures in the grids, a problem of smart metering, a problem of looking to the water sector with a, the with a new technology and, and the new industry. If you see uh, the elect electricity and gas, they are all around, all inside the 4.0 industry. And uh, water, it's one, one step behind. So, yes, we, all over the world you have to replace the pipes, but it's much more than that to have a, a good management of the sector. So this is the, as all you know, this is a framework agreement. It sets a framework of cooperation, in particular, in order to have a narrowing of focus, when the two prime ministers met, this was one of the key areas already identified. So what we did was we began working on this so that to establish a particular framework. And within the framework also, you see when you have a copy of the MOU, it is monitored. That we've got the wider themes within the water sector sanitation, and then we've highlighted four specific projects, and that particular part of the annexation will keep adding in this sector. There is a lot of possibilities of future cooperation between Portugal and Goa. Both ministers agreed to this and the state chief secretary gave some details on what could be other ventures of cooperation. We were discussing about the houses in Goa which are also in dilapidated condition because of some of the people who are staying in Portugal cannot come here and even to have a maintain that houses. But definitely it is our prime duty as a government of Goa to take the help of the Portuguese government and even to implement some of the good things towards this system. One is uh, in Portugal they have a very strong uh, system, a private company, it's a no mistake, running the Posada, basically the traditional houses, putting back on the tourism market. And we were introduced to the management who looked at the possibility of could they extend the similar expertise for Goa. There's a whole market of outbound tourism in Portugal to Goa waiting to happen. Independently, uh, we have the advantage of having uh, Singh Saab also as Secretary of Tourism. In fact, presently he is considering a proposal from the main uh, travel tour operators of Portugal who would like to host a congress with the Goa and looking at the potential of hosting the Congress in Goa next year. So 
So we are seeing that that possibility and that visibility. So it's going to be a step by step approach, but we are hoping that the technical part, if we can get this one correct and we see feet on the ground, we see uh, the development that takes place, the transport technology, iron out, the financial and the administrative issues, other sectors in a modular sense will be easy to come by. With Chief Reporter Glenn Costa, Video Journal, Yeshwin Parapin Panaji.